I'm speaking to you rich and wealthy people like I don't need to name any names you're well known because you're on TV all the time um, for some reason you were given the role in this life to show us to help us find our own integrity by that which you mirror to the rest of the world by mirroring your shadows to the rest of the world you are helping us know what integrity is and what lack of integrity is I just want to say today to anyone that is responsible for these seemingly quote-unquote natural disasters, for any one of you that has insight, insider information and know-how, and in some way is responsible, it is okay for you to own your part, to own your responsibility, to find your own integrity in your deeds, in your dishonest deeds. You can try to keep concealing and hiding it, but the people know. Mostly you are hiding from your own integrity. Something about you makes you afraid of your own integrity. And maybe you have done so many evil misdeeds in your life that you are truly ashamed of, too ashamed to own and admit. I'm hoping that the people of the world will offer you forgiveness and unconditional love because like every one of us at some point had to face our shadows to come to come into harmony with our own being you don't have to hide yourself in lies and deceit to avoid the judgment of your true self. In fact, if you would find the integrity of your own being and had to admit that you were a screw up, you would find compassion and unconditional acceptance by the people you are currently lying to. This is a call for you to search for your own integrity. Stop hiding behind your um, extravagant philanthropy, which is not passing the purity test. Find the integrity for yourself, within yourself, and come clean. Stop living a double life. Right? Stop living a, a double life. Find that pure love for yourself. There's no need to hide. Somebody's fingerprints are all over the disasters that are happening in the world. Whether that is Klaus Schwab, King Charles, 
or smaller players like Bill Gates, Oprah. Come clean. Come clean to love and a love for humanity more than your love for money and power. I call on you to come clean. Own your mistakes and stop covering them up. Bring true prosperity and harmony and peace to this world. It's in your power. You have been given the means to be in all the powerful positions. Use your power in an honorable way.